And we're off. The bronze medal game has begun. South Africa has the ball on the far side. They play it around in the midfield. Play it through and score. What a great way to start this game for South Africa. A beautiful shot placed over the outstretched right arm of the goalkeeper. DRC plays the ball around in the midfield. He crosses the ball to the left. Dribbles it into the midfield. Plays it around for a bit. Great teamwork until the goalie finally stops the shot in the bottom right corner. What a great heads up play by the keeper. DRC play it from the corner. The ball is turned over just outside the box. Plays it to the attacker who nets it into the top left corner of the net. DRC keep the ball into the opposing half. Pass the ball in midfield. Play it deep. They play it back into the box. After getting denied by the keeper, South Africa is able to clear the play. DRC play the ball around in the attack. They play it through and get denied high by the keeper. DRC play it in from the corner. He plays it back wide. Plays it to his deep man. To the edge of the box and denied by the goalkeeper. Crossed in for South Africa and headed just wide of the goal. Regulation would prove to be no good, so we're forced to go into extra time. He nets it into the top right corner of the net. He starts it from the top left of the box, dribbles it into the 18 before sneaking it past the defender and into the back of the net. South Africa with the fast break takes a shot. And the goalie taps it off of the crossbar, lands in front of the player and into the back of the net. The goalie really stood no chance on that one. DRC passes the ball around in the attack. And the ball is turned away and denied by the keeper. Extra time would prove to be no good, so we're forced to go into penalty kicks. DRC is the first one to strike. And what a great save by the goalie. South Africa fools the keeper and that's the ball in the bottom right corner of the net. What a strike. DRC takes a shot directly at the keeper. That is not a good strike. What a phenomenal save by Congo's goalie. Fully outstretched in the top left corner of the net. Congo nets the ball in the bottom left corner of the net, fooling the goalie with his decision. South Africa shoots the ball nearly directly towards the goalie who somehow misses to save the ball. DRC shoots it past the goalie as he stands there idle as a statue. South Africa puts the ball into the bottom left corner of the net. Perfectly placed shot. Congo must score to stay alive here. And what a poor strike which is easily contained by the goalie. South Africa celebrate as a team as they have now won the bronze medal of the CAF 2024 championship. Predicting the final of the CAF 2024 championship, in the finals we got Cote d'Ivoire against Nigeria. This game proved to be real competitive, so let's get right into it. Cote d'Ivoire with the ball in the midfield, playing it back and forth between their players. Plays it long, holds it up, plays it back into the middle, down to the attacker, and scores a beautiful goal into the right corner of the net. What a beautiful play by Cote d'Ivoire. Stringing together five, six passes together before putting it into the back of the net. Holds it up nicely as an attacking nine. Passes it through and puts a great ball into the back of the net. What a great teamwork play by Cote d'Ivoire. And he commits a foul. And Cote d'Ivoire is about to take a penalty kick. He's lining up for the kick. All eyes on him. I wonder where he's going to go. 
And what a beautiful strike into the top left corner of the net. Celebrating with his teammates. As they all gather in style. Nigeria intercepts the ball in midfield, passes it through, and he strikes it off of a turn. What a great strike from the right to the left foot. Truly no one was covering him inside the penalty box. Terrible defending by Cote d'Ivoire, putting Nigeria on the scoreboard. Cote d'Ivoire with a fast break, dribbling down, and strikes it into the top left corner of the net. Such precision play by Cote d'Ivoire. Bad defending again by Nigeria. It gives Cote d'Ivoire a 3-1 lead in this game. And he just misses the net wide right. I believe that's too little too late for Nigeria. As they're not going to come back from this 3-1 deficit. As you can see from that match, Cote d'Ivoire got first place. And they're not going to host CAF 2024 Championship. Nigeria is going to fall to second place, unfortunately. And that's the way that she goes.